Greetings. Is it herbs you seek? Medicines to mute a bashful maid's inhibitions? Or a concoction to raise your own courage for a second go? That it? No other weeds or brews? Aye. One to make your hair grow. Another to do the opposite. An easer of pain, a calmer of heartburn. Tell me what ails you. Hear about the contract. Whew. A taker at long last. Poverty in everyone's lips, but when you've a job to give, no one's eager. Folk are lazy, that's the truth of it. Stick to the point, if you don't mind. Uh, right, right, right. Sorry for the chatter. I'm anxious, is all. Been so long without any word. <sighs> it's my apprentice, Falkert. I sent him to the Dead White Wood. You know, the forest near Martin Foy's farmstead. I I'd run out of hand fiber, see, and the, the damned stuff grows thick as weeds there. Let me guess. Hasn't returned. Yes. Uh, uh, no, he hasn't. Please, find him and bring him back safe and sound. No promises, but I can certainly look for him. Any distinguishing features? How will I recognize him? Hmm. Got to think on that. Well, he's a, a halfling, as I am. A light hair. Will that do? It'll have to. So long. Slower. Herbalist's cart. Got some blood here. Blood. Dried. A few days old. Trail's gone cold. Need to look around. Ask. Maybe someone's seen him. Jude! Sharp now! Oh. We've company! What's brought you to these parts, Master? Lost your way? No. Looking for someone. Ah. Do tell. Perhaps we can help. What is this place, exactly? A village. Plain to see. Abandoned huts is about all I see. Aye. It's only us now. Young folk have gone off to the city seeking work, and the old have all died. Ain't that right, Judd? Right as rain. Looking for someone named Fulkert. Light-haired halfling. Ring any bells? Aye. Saw a little one round here. Out picking herbs. Mm-hmm. Till he got hurt. Ran across a trail of blood. Trail led me here. It is just as you say. Wolves had attacked him. He fled here seeking shelter. I told him. Back to your city, young master. Plenty such dangers hereabouts. But the fool was stubborn. Said he had to pick his blooms aforehand. Ventured back into the woods. And that were the last of him. Heard howling that night. Sent shivers down my spine. So where are his remains? Wolves would have left something. His boots, maybe. Didn't go looking. But he's too old to go tramping about in the woods. So long.
light-haired halfling. Must be Fulkert. Ripped open, gutted, and drained. No way to determine the cause of death. into your larder. Meat-rich diet. That what you like? Master. Not at all. Tate like that. Best hope not, or you'll be next to get a hook through your neck. The wolves killed him. Him and the others. We but gather the bodies. That's the truth. We're old and frail. We've no strength to plow or sow, but we gotta eat. I pity, Master. Vow never to eat another bite of human flesh, and I'll let you live. Oh, I swear. Swear it on dear Mother Melitale, of the eternal fire, on. Keep the gods out of it. Swear on your heads, which I will take if you break your vow. I... I... we swear. You live in the middle of nowhere. It's out of my way. But I'll be back. Better believe I'll be back. Hey there. Volkert, your apprentice. I know what happened to him. Out with it. I've gone near daft with worry. Ran into trouble. A freak event. Of what type? Did monsters attack him? Mm hmm. Could say that. Ah. A treasure, that lad. Dutiful. Mannered. Such a shame. Well, here's your gold. I trust it will serve you well. 